Hey guys, welcome back to Dave's Small Engine channel here on YouTube. Um, I'm just going to show you quickly why I have a steel MS310 chainsaw apart in pieces. Uh, I started this uh, repair before I started the channel, so uh, we've got some catching up to do. Um, this is a steel prosumer level chainsaw, so a steel consumer slash pro grade chainsaw. Uh, it's got a 20 inch bar, and as you can see, it's uh, apart in a whole bunch of pieces. Um, the pro level saws are a lot easier to work on. Um, so if you're going to get into repair on a, a prosumer or consumer level chainsaw um, by steel, just uh, be prepared that uh, there will be a, a substantial amount of um, takedown and rebuild as you go along. So uh, this saw here uh, ran without oil, it appears to me, or had a very hard and long life. Um, so as you can see here, there's some scoring on this cylinder and, um, if you have scoring on your cylinder due to lack of oil in the fuel or, um, some debris that got inside of the uh, cylinder and piston, um, you will find that you will lose compression and the engine will not run as it's supposed to. So, uh, or run at all for that matter. So let's see if I can get some good lighting in here. This cylinder is nice and scored. So with that scoring, that means that you are lacking compression. And unfortunately, that oftentimes means that it won't run, if at all. Or if it does, the performance will be poor. So uh, you can either um, buy an OEM steel um, piston and uh, cylinder assembly. That will be very costly or you can go the aftermarket route, which is uh, far more reasonable. So I've picked up a, uh, I think it was 60 or $70, a um, aftermarket piston and cylinder um, assembly, and I will do a video on how I rebuilt it and how it runs um, here shortly, just waiting on those parts. Again, thanks for uh, watching Dave Small Engines. This is uh, just one of the many projects that I seem to have on the go. Uh, again, it's a steel MS310 chainsaw and hope to have it up and running soon. Stay tuned. Take care.